guys, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today's yoga routine is going to work your entire body with an intense focus on your thighs. So get ready to tone those thighs front and back. All right, so to get started, we are going to walk to the front of our mat, leaving some space in front of our toes in the edge of the mat here. Go ahead and inhale, bring the arms all the way up, reach up and out of the hips, and exhale down, reach for the mat here, drop the head, relax the back so you can round the back. Okay, go ahead and slowly roll up. And again, inhale, arms up. Open your mouth as you exhale all the way down. Enjoy the stretch in the back of the legs and those hamstrings. Slowly roll up. One more time. Inhale, arms up. And exhale down. From here, I'd like you to step back into plank. Okay, core is tight, glutes are tight, back is flat. Make sure your glutes are low, not way up here in the air. Hold here, 10 breaths. Go ahead and step forwards. Slowly roll up. And again, inhale, bring those arms all the way up. And exhale down, reach for the mat. Step back into plank. You're going to shift over to your right hand. So plank on the right side. Try to make sure that your right hand is lined up below the right shoulder here. Stack the feet. Tighten those obliques, left arm up. Hold for 10 breaths. Back to center, step forwards, and slowly roll up. Inhale, arms all the way up, and exhale down, reach for the mat. Step back into plank. Shift over to the left hand this time. Left plank, again, line up the hand, left hand beneath the left shoulder as best you can. Stack the feet, right arm up and hold. Back to center, step forwards, 
and slowly roll up. All right, now that we're nice and warm, we're gonna get to the core of our routine today. So we're still at the fronts of our mats. We're going to squat 10 times, and then we are going to jump back into a lunge. So a right lunge, so the right leg is going to be forwards here, and then we'll start with warrior one. Okay, so that's just a rundown of what's coming up. So go ahead and widen your stance, and 10 squats. Inhale down, exhale up. And that was 10, okay? So jump back into a lunge. So just a little hop, not a big deal there. Okay, so warrior one, you want the front foot to face forwards. Turn the back foot sideways. Line up your heels with one another as best you can. Again, it's hard if you don't have a mirror, but just go by feel. And hips are gonna try to open to the side. Try to face them forward as best you can. Okay, and bring the arms up. Keep them straight and close to the ears. And hold here. And if your body is leaning forward, try to keep it straight. Up and down, okay? So kind of perpendicular to the ground. No angle there. Five more breaths. Okay, relax the arms down and go ahead and walk the back foot forward, hop it forward, whatever works best for you. And get into squatting position again. Ten squats. Last one. Okay, jump into a lunge. Left foot stays, well, is going to be forward, stays in the front here. So hop there, line those feet. Warrior one, hips forwards, facing forwards. We don't want them to lean forwards, remember. Straight up and down here. To a right lunge, so right foot forwards here, and we have warrior two. So again, align those heels, hips can stay open to the side, bring your arms into a T, try to keep them at shoulder level as best you can, face forward and hold here. Relax the arms down, bring the back foot forwards here. Okay, ready to squat. <clears throat> Ten squats. Last one. 
last one. Very nice. Okay, do your hop into a left lunge. Okay, again, warrior two. Line up your heels. Open those hips to the side. Make a T with the arms. Ten breaths here. Relax the arms down, bring the back foot forwards, get ready to squat again. Okay, you're doing great, 10 squats. Last one, very nice, okay. So we have warrior three now, so you're gonna come to the middle of your mat, Right foot is the base foot, right leg, base leg to start with. Okay, bring the left foot behind you, big toe down on the mat here. Slowly lean forwards, bringing the left leg up, getting your body, whoop, I'm touching the wall here, parallel to the ground, and extend the arms out in front of you. Okay, 10 breaths here. If you fall out, no big deal. Slowly come out. Very nice job. Okay, 10 squats. Back to the middle of your mat. Left foot is the base foot. Left leg, base leg. <laughs> and warrior three. Take your time here. Oh, touching the ball again. Sorry, guys. Slowly come out. Very nice job. Great job. Okay. So, time squats again. How are you feeling? Good, hopefully. All right. Let's do it. Last one. And ten. All right. So hop back into a right lunge, and we are going to get into right angle pose. So align your heels. <clears throat> get into warrior two, and from here, reach forwards with the right hand, drop it on the inside of the ankle. Knee stays bent, right knee stays bent here, okay? And bring the left hand up. Hold here, 10 breaths. Stay as you are. Stay rooted into the ground with that right hand. Bring the left hand up, reaching forwards over the head. Ten more breaths here.
Very nice. All right, you can slowly stand up. Bring the back foot forwards. Ten squats. Last one. Ten. Very nice. Okay, hop into a left lunge. Align your heels here. Okay, warrior two, two begin. Reach forward with the left hand, drop it on the inside of the ankle, right arm up, 10 breaths here. Right hand, right arm, reach overhead, forwards. Ten more breaths. One more, and ten. Okay, hop into a right lunge. Align the heels here. And warrior two. Straighten the front leg. Reach forwards with the right hand. Drop it on the inside of the ankle. We want the front knee to stay bent. <laughs> We do not want the front knee to stay bent. We want the front leg to stay straight here. So if you find that your knee is bending, if you're reaching all the way down to the ground, feel free to rest the hand on the leg, even up on the thigh if you need to, okay? Hold for 10 breaths. Very nice. Okay, slowly stand up. Keep your feet as they are here. I would like you to bring the right arm up. And you're going to reach back like reverse warrior, but we're going to keep the front leg straight. So you will feel a pretty intense stretch in this front hip flexor. Okay? So rest the back hand either above, above or below the knee. We don't want to rest on the knee because we might hurt the knee. Okay? So. Keep that leg straight, reach up, and hold 10 breaths here. Okay, slowly come out of the pose. Bring that back foot forwards. Okay, time to squat again. Ten squats. Last one right there. All right, so go ahead and hop into a left lunge. Align the heels. Warrior two, straighten the front leg, reach forwards with the left hand, drop it on the inside of the ankle, bring the right hand up, gaze up towards that hand, 10 breaths here, triangle pose.
slowly stand up, leaving your feet as they are. Right leg stays straight here. Go ahead and rest the right hand above or below the back knee. Bring that left hand up and hold here. Relax the arms down, bring the back foot forwards. All right, very nice job there. Hope your legs feel good. Now we are going to, again, start at the front of our mats. Feet together, inhale, arms up. Exhale, all the way down, reach for the mat here. Inhale, up to flat back. Hands to your shins, flatten out any curve you may have in your back, and look straight ahead. Exhale down, reach for the mat. Step back into plank. And you're going to chaturanga into upward dog. So come all the way down to the bottom of a push-up position, elbows close to your sides, slide forwards. Upward dog here. Okay, so you're pressing the tops of your feet into the mat if you can. If you need to rest your knees down on the mat, that's okay too. Press your hands down into the mat as well to bring the shoulders down and away from the ears. 10 breaths here. Shift back to downward dog. Use those arms in your core to help you do so. Down dog, arms and legs are straight, back is flat. I would like you to drive your heels down towards the mat. If they don't touch, no worries. And also, make sure that rather than your head being out here by your hands, you push those hands into the mat angling your head down, bringing it closer to your feet here. Okay, and additionally, lift your butt, your sit bones, up towards the sky. As you do that, you'll feel a nice stretch all the way down the back of the leg. Okay, hold for 10 breaths. Float the right leg up, bring it up here. You're going to bring it underneath your body, bring the knee to your nose, and power the leg up so that you get your left foot to come up off the ground a little bit. Okay, so again, let me show you one more time. Knee to nose, power up. Okay, so we have 10 of those. Start with that leg up, knee to nose. Power up is one, two, three, four, five, you're doing great, six, seven, hang in there guys. into child's pose for just a moment here. Okay. And a 
hands up to you. You can either have the knees together like this or wild, wild, wide child's pose. Okay, I like this. I really enjoy the stretch that it gives my inner thighs. So whatever you'd like, 10 breaths here. Slowly sit up. Take your time here. <sighs> All right, go ahead and slowly stand up here. <clears throat> Walk to the front of your mat. Feet together. Inhale, arms all the way up. And exhale down. Reach for the mat. Remember to relax the head. Inhale, up to flat back, hands to your shins, head is up, looking straight ahead. Exhale, down. Step back into plank. Chaturanga into upward dog. Hold, upward dog, for 10 breaths. Shift back to downward dog. Okay, 10 breaths here. Okay, go ahead and slowly sit up. Take your time. Right, we're gonna stand up and walk to the front of our mat again. Okay, feet together, inhale, arms up. And exhale down, reach for the mat. Relax that head. Inhale, up to flat back, hands to your shins, head is up, exhale down, step back into plank, chaturanga into upward dog, hold, 10 breaths here.
downward dog. Again, hold for ten breaths. Remember to lift those sit bones up towards the ceiling. Flip the right leg up, three-legged dog, ten breaths here. Relax the leg down and relax into child's pose. Okay, go ahead and slowly sit up. Doing great here, we're almost done. Stand up, walk to the front of your mat. Okay, feet together. Nice big inhale all the way up. And exhale down, reach for the mat. Inhale up to flat back. Hands to your shins, heads up. Exhale down. Step back into plank. Chaturanga into upward dog. Ten breaths. Downward dog. Again, ten breaths here. Flip the left leg up, three-legged dog, ten breaths. Relax the leg down and again relax into child's pose. down on your back. And from here, we are going to push up into wheel. Okay? 
okay. So if you need to modify, go ahead and just simply lift the glutes up and hold here, just in a bridge. Otherwise, go all the way up into wheel. All right. So we're going to hold for 10 breaths. Go ahead, push up. Slowly relax down. Okay, lengthen the body out. And relax those arms by your sides. Palms are facing up. Legs are relaxed here. Okay, so curl the toes, tighten them. And allow them to relax. Go ahead and tighten your calves and relax them. Squeeze the thighs and the glutes and relax them. Go ahead and tighten your core and allow it to relax. Make fist with your hands, squeezing them tightly. Tighten those arms as well. And relax and down. Bring your shoulders up towards your ears and relax them. Okay, go ahead and lift the eyebrows up towards your hairline and relax them down. Okay, so every muscle in your body should be relaxed. So I'm going to ask you to inhale for a count of three. You will hold for a count of three, and then you will exhale for a count of three. Okay, as you inhale, make sure you're doing so through your nose, and as you exhale, we'd like you to do that through your mouth. Okay, we'll go up to a count of six, and then work our way back down. Okay, inhale, two, three, Hold, two, three, exhale, two, three. Inhale, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Hold, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. And for six, inhale, two, three, four, five, six. Hold, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale, two, three, four, five, six. Back down to five. Inhale, two, three, four, five, hold, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, and four, inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, and three, inhale, two, three, hold, two, three, exhale, two, three. So now I'd just like you to relax, breathe on your own, in through the nose, out through the mouth.
close your mouth, so now you're inhaling and exhaling. So through the nose, try to relax your tongue so it floats to the top of your mouth. Keep your eyes closed and slowly roll onto one side. Continue to relax here. Whenever you're ready, you can go ahead and slowly sit up. Take your time, as much time as you need to, so you're not dizzy. Okay, great job today. I hope you're nice and relaxed now and that you enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll say that you have a great weekend. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.